Hey everybody, how's it going? Welcome in. My name's Amanda, for those of you who don't know me, and this is The Connected Conduit, where I tippy-tap in and I bring through messages for your greatest and highest good. Do keep in mind this is a general reading, it's not a one-to-one, -one, which means some messages may resonate and others may not, and that's okay. Just pick up what feels good and confirms your own intuition and leave the rest for someone else, okay? All right, let's get into this. So I really want to focus on the Divine Masculine in this reading, and I basically just want to bring through messages from your Masculine to you at this time, okay? So... Your Masculine is wondering if you've forgotten about them. Your silence is very concerning. They're wondering where you are, what you're doing, who you're with, they're wondering if you're okay. Um, they're starting to feel like you have slipped away. This could be over. This is it. You know, I hear a masculine going, have I messed this up? Have I totally screwed this up? Is this done? And if that's the case, you guys, your masculine sat with that feeling of you turning your back and walking away for good and like the connection being over and they sat with that feeling and it destroyed them. It was very, very, very heartbreaking. It was gut-wrenching is what I'm hearing. So your masculine doesn't want this to be over and I feel that they will be reaching out with communication because they just, they need to know. They need to know how you're doing, if you're okay, what you've been up to. They miss you, they miss you like crazy. And they really need to know like if they've mess this up or are you going to be receptive will you open up hear them out okay that's what i'm that's what i'm getting so let's let's pull on it you guys they're really really missing your your communication conversations they're really really missing the things that you would talk about. They're missing the support and guidance that you would offer them. They're also missing just joking around with you because I see that the two of you really, really, really have a great time when you when you get together and you talk. You guys like sling the jokes, you know. <laughs> um, you lift each other up. It, it's really nice, it's really nice. So they're missing that. They're really wanting communication. Divine Feminine, I feel that you're still very much connected to your masculine. However, I feel that you pulled away because you had to. It was like self-preservation, okay? Because for many of you, this masculine wasn't budging. They weren't giving you what you needed, right? So it's almost like, well, I had no other choice. I had to turn my back. I had to detach. I had to walk away. I had to take care of myself. Um, you know, like Divine Feminine, you have stuff to do. You have an empire to run. People look up to you. You have a lot of responsibilities, as does your masculine. You know, you both are just people <laughs> living life. Um, you know, everyday things like chores, groceries, laundry, <laughs> getting the car fixed, rotating the tires on your car. I don't know why I'm getting that. Perhaps some of you have recently rotated the tires on your car or something like that. Or, yeah got an oil change okay so I'm just um let's just get some energy around your masculine the eight of wands <laughs> yes exactly so the eight of wands represents communication text messages a phone call emails um dms on your social media this is your masculine reaching out with communication very quickly, very suddenly it comes in, a whole bunch of messages maybe, like pop, 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 pop. Hey, how are you? I haven't heard from you in a while, or something like this. The Eight of Wands speaks to your manifestations coming in. So Divine Feminine, I feel that communication's coming in, you guys, from your masculine. It's coming in. So what do they want to say here? What do they want to say to you from the heart space? They really feel like time is slipping away from them, you guys. 
Yeah, the Ten of Swords. See, they're so worried that it's over. They're worried that you turned your back and things are over for good, that you're done with them, that you're done with this connection. I don't feel that you are Divine Feminine, but this is how your masculine's feeling. And I'm telling you, they sat with this feeling and it it was gut-wrenching. Like I said earlier, that's what I was hearing the masculine say. Like, oh, that's that makes me feel sick. You know, I feel sick if that's the case. So let's take um let's take a peek at the feminine's energy here. The feminine's energy, all right? The Ace of Cups, yes. So Divine Feminine, you're all about self-love, self-care, self-preservation. But you also love your masculine. This, your love for your masculine isn't going anywhere. So I feel like you're holding space for them. I'm hearing you've been keeping their heart safe in your hands. Divine Masculine, your heart is safe with me, is what I hear a feminine say to her masculine or to his masculine, okay? Your heart is safe in my hands. Aw. Okay. Straight from the masculine's heart space, spirit. Let's get some energy here for the collective. The Four of Cups. They're missing you. They're feeling rejected. Life is not the same without you in it. When you leave, the magic is gone. The spark is gone. Things are very bleak, dull, boring. I'm getting a song. I miss you like crazy every minute of every day. I miss you like crazy even more than words can say. Girl, when I'm down, when your love's not around. I've brought through that song before. It's by the Moffats. <laughs> you guys remember the Moffats? Mm -bop, dip, dop, ba, do, <laughs> uh, anyway, so we have Temperance coming out, and they're they're really tired of waiting. They want to heal this connection. They want to put an end to the silence. They really, really want to look at your face. They want to make eye contact with you because whenever you guys have eye contact, you both feel a zing, okay? You know, it's the zing. You get the, the shock to the system. It's like an electric current that runs through your body when you guys look in each other's eyes. Knight of Cups, straight from your masculine's heart space, they love you, they adore you, that they're fantasizing about coming towards you, and they've prepared their speech. They've really put a lot of thought into the, the communication that you will be receiving. This is very romantic communication coming towards you, Divine Feminine, okay? Yes, Two of Cups. Two of Cups, partnership coming together they really 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 want to spend some alone time with you just the two just the two of you they want to hold your hand i want to hold your hand i want to hold your hand okay Trust. This situation is calling for you to have faith. I feel like your masculine is trying so hard to trust this journey and to have trust in you and the connection that you share, but they're really, really struggling here because the silence is deafening. The silence is deafening and they want to be near you. They want to touch you. They want to hold you. They want to smell you. They want to kiss you. They want to romance you past life relationship on the bottom. This is what your masculine wants to do to you. Okay, you may be finding that energetically you're sensing your masculine come up from behind you and embrace you just like this and like whisper things into your ear and kiss your neck. 
very sweet, romantic, sensual energy coming through from your masculine right now. I recently channeled some messages from the Masculine Collective. So these are new ones that I haven't pulled before. This is the first time I'm using this little self-made deck. There's a lot of energy in my heart space. Your Divine Masculine they are bursting for you. Yeah, how do you keep pulling me in? I feel like this could have been a masculine who tried to detach or for whatever reason, it wasn't for lack of wanting you or desiring you or loving you, but sometimes, you know, in these connections, the masculine or you feminine, you guys get triggered, right? So um, they may have tried to pull away because this love was very intense or perhaps they were already committed in another relationship. Um, whatever the situation was, it will be different for all of you. Every time that you guys would part, they would just be pulled right back to you like a magnet. Whoops. Oh, okay. Those flew out super, super fast. Let's see. You never cease to amaze me. Your masculine thinks you are phenomenal, incredible, very intelligent, very powerful, very inspiring and surprising. You keep them on their toes. You really do. They've never met anyone like you. Look at this, you guys. I can't believe I just let you slip away. Exactly. This is what your masculine's feeling, you guys. A lot of sadness, a lot of regret, a lot of guilt over just literally watching you walk away and not doing anything about it at the time. So they want to rectify this. They want to change the circumstance. They want to come in. They're not willing to let you go because the thought of letting you go, it kills them. It's, it, it's painful, you guys. So painful. All right, one more. Just one more. I wish you were the mother of my children. Wow. So your masculine thinks so highly of you, divine feminine. So highly that they wish you were the mother of their children or the father of their children. Okay, just take it how it resonates. So they're not, they're not going to let you slip away. I feel that divine feminine um this is just lit a fire under your masculine's butt so get ready for communication and get ready to receive i'm hearing i'm all yours uh, divine feminine i am all yours okay so i hope this message finds you well i hope you enjoyed it and that it resonated with you if it did and you guys feel called to like subscribe leave me a comment. Let me know how it resonated with you. That would be amazing. I would appreciate that so very much. I'm sending you all the good vibes and stay aligned, my friends. Stay aligned. Bye.